Hello lovely people, hope you're all doing well. Um, today I've got a Sainsbury's food haul to share with you. It's a big one. Um, but yeah, hope you're all doing well. We have had a good week um, this week. Not a lot of sleep happened this week. Uh, Ruben is just really struggling with his teeth again. Doesn't seem to get a break, the poor thing. Um, so we currently have tooth number 13 and 14 coming through. Ooh, coming up. Um, yeah, so the last three days I've been awake before half past four with him. So long days. Um, but yeah, he can't help it. But apart from that, uh, it's a good week. My Christmas tree is... <laughs> been stripped from the middle down we only have decorations from like halfway up Reuben really likes them what can I say and it's that thing things are sparkly and shiny and he's one you can't really tell him no but no good week um getting rather prepared for Christmas I was feeling quite confident about how prepared I was for Christmas um and then I was like because in my head I'm like oh no we're doing really well and then I check my spreadsheet. Um, so pretty much present wise, almost everything is either here or ordered. Um, anything's really left. Um, I have to find something for my mum to buy for John. Just because she wants to buy him something he wants. Um, which is hard with John because, you know, he, you, you ask him. He never. John never asks for a present. He'll never, oh, for Christmas or, or for my birthday can I have he doesn't do that and if you say well, what would you like for christmas he's always kind of like oh i don't need anything oh i don't know he never asks so it's quite difficult so yeah i've got to find something that my mum can buy for him and then <laughs> kind of dawned on me john's responsible for his his mum and dad i know he's bought his dad's because i i know he's got it and i kind of messaged him this morning like if you ordered your mum something for christmas um, he read it and he's not replied. So that's either a no or he's just really busy at work today. Um, and then apart from that, I um, had some professional photos taken of Ruben on Sunday, just gone. Um, so I need to get some of those printed. And present-wise, everything is then like ordered and purchased. And it's just the mammoth wrap to do. Um, and then distribute cards and things and... It's just food shopping. Um, I think decoration wise, we're not going crazy this year just because it's it's too much temptation for Reuben. It just feels unfair to do that to him. Um, yeah, Father Christmas is booked. We went to our first Christmas do last night. Um, one of John's social club things. Um, very nice, very civilised. No alcohol was consumed. I won a llama on the raffle. Well, I won a white bottle of wine on the raffle and I traded it with another lady who won a stuffed llama. Because <laughs> still not drinking. Um, and she was not impressed with this llama. I'm like, Ruben would like that. Let's let's swap. Um, but yeah, it was a nice, it was a nice evening. Um, I've got my works Christmas thing next week, as long as plan B that was announced yesterday doesn't change that. But yeah, life is it's Christmas is kind of things are, are, are coming together. I'm not ready. Like, I've got a few people on my, like, social media. They're like, wrapped all my presents, everything's done. I'm like, I'm not that organised, but I'm, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Anyway, groceries, food shop. Uh, this is a big one. This cost me £97. Mostly because I spent 15 quid on soft drink. Which I didn't mean to do. Um, like, I do the shopping and... I always go, oh, is there anything you fancy to John? You know, kind of thinking, cause sometimes you go, oh, can we have steak? Or you'll go, oh, I fancy burritos or something like that. But most of the time he goes, oh, no, whatever. Uh, and this week you go, oh, can we have Pepsi instead of Coke? Yeah. Is that Ruben waking up? Ruben's staring. I was like, yeah, no problem. Bang the Pepsi in the uh, shopping trolley forgot to take the other pop out so we have all the pop in the world um but hey pop lasts a long time so it's fine right 
Open is stirring. Let's see how much of this I can get before I have to get him out of his bed. And there, oh, see, Eggie's legs. <laughs> and there we go. There is our shopping. All the pop in the universe, as I said, four bottles of Pepsi as requested by John. Forgot to take the Coke out of the basket. So there's four bottles of Coke, a bottle of Impto, and a bottle of Rosé Schleur, which is, if you don't know, it's like a non-alcoholic fruit juice thing. It's like a wine substitute. Oh, no, Ruben wants to get up. Bear with me. Is that a nice nap? Uh-huh. Uh you doing good? Yeah. Yeah? <gasps> really? Is that what you dreamed of? <laughs> you're still sleepy. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Okay, back to the shopping. So, we got toilet roll in the Reuben section. Some bear paws, uh, strawberry and apple fruit, dried stuff. Um, he had these at John's mum and dad's. Apparently he likes them. So we thought we'd give him a pack. Uh, cheese and herb stars. They're like suitable from 12 months. So he's in the right age category for them. But yeah, got some chest stars. We have all the yoghurt. Okay, okay. There you go. He wanted a bit of Lego. Um, all of the yoghurt. Ruben has ha obviously had <clears throat> yoghurt before, but he's really into like these squishy ones and doing it himself at the moment. He's such a big boy now, it's crazy. But yeah, he likes to do it himself. We've got some of these that you can self-fill. Um, so we do that as well. But... These are these were on offer, so this is actually worked out cheaper. So we've got banana, two banana, two peach and apricot, two raspberry, and I think there's two strawberry. And then I got some apple and mango fruit and pear and apple. These are to go on his porridge in the morning when he has his breakfast. Got some chocolate because it's Christmas. Um, normal Lindor and mint. Obviously, they're not for Ruben. And we've got some cranberry sauce because we're going to do like Christmas rolls, either festive rolls with like pigs in blankets and stuffing. I think either Saturday for lunch or Sunday after church, one or the other. Um, cheese strings and Paw Patrol yogurts. And we've got two chocolate orange. And then some cheddars. And cinnamon rolls. We used to have these all the time. Or cinnamon swirls. We used to have these all the time. I haven't had them in ages. But yeah. Coleslaw. Fry light, which I've been meaning to buy for like a fortnight. I'm forgetting. So I remembered this week, so I'm happy with that. Some mini reindeers. Some cucumber. You're okay. You got Legos. Yeah. Cucumber for Ruben. Shortbread stars, soft cheese, cheddar, wraps for lunches, pretzels, a chocolate chip. I always say this word wrong. One of those. We have already bought one of these that we were going to have over Christmas, uh, but John and I ate it <laughs> with a cup of coffee after our tea one night. <laughs> Um, I got two packets of jacket potatoes or baking potatoes, I think they call them. Uh, a thing of onions and a thing of little potatoes. We have some salad, some mange too, some stuffing, and Mr. Kipling festive bake wells. Skips, because Ruben has currently decided that quavers are so two weeks ago and skips are the new thing. Uh, there's the other bag of potatoes. We've got some bananas, grapes, new potatoes with herbies. Is it herb? Parsley. Yeah, mint, parsley and chive and I will add garlic to those. Some luncheon meat for the pups. A singular red pepper. At <laughs> uh, the weekend I went to Marks and Spencers and um, ended up buying, uh, went there to buy a Christmas jumper and walk through the food hall because they've got yummy things and ended up actually buying quite a lot of veg. So didn't need a whole lot this week. 
uh, tea cakes, pan of chocolat, Warburton fruit loaf, uh, and Warburton rolls for these festive rolls that I'm going to do at some point this weekend. Um, salmon spinach en croute, pulled pork. This is my one and only substitution. I ordered a Sainsbury's pulled pork. They've given me the Jolly Hog pulled pork. I think it's like a pound more expensive. It's fine. Um, some chicken breast fillets. Two lots. Some triple cooked chips. John loves these. Um, and this, oh, this is new. Some smoky piri piri chicken breast sizzlers. I think they're going to be lush. The reviews were good on the website. Um, pigs in blankets, the long ones. And then frozen, I've got two boxes of the chicken original chicken and char grills this is just the easiest thing when i'm working home um and obviously i'm going to break up from work soon for christmas um and so lunch is at home it's just simple chuck that in a wrap with a bit of salad a bit of coleslaw a bit of mayo done uh fish fingers ruben loves fishing fish fingers but he's not at as many this week he's been more um We've been having a lot of proggy because I, oh, after I went to Marks and Spencer's on Sunday, I went to the Polish shop. Um, so we didn't go through his normal volume, but so one box of fish fingers, two packets of toad in the hole for me and John, lamb shanks. I, gotta admit, didn't realise these were frozen. Um, so it's going to be interesting. I don't know if I'm going to fit it all. I'm just kind of have to de-package it, I think. Put the cardboard straight in the recycling. And then it will should fit in the freezer. Uh, a big bag of broccoli and a big bag of peas. Reuben's two favourite vegetables. Yeah? And that's this week's shopping. Um, yeah, that's the shopping. Oh, are you telling them? And you got your Legos. <laughs> so chatty. So chatty. Yes, you are. Right, so that is this week's shopping. Um, I hope you're all doing well, staying safe, feeling okay. Um, if you're here in, in well, it's only England at the moment, obviously there was an announcement yesterday by Boris that changed the rules for England. Um, is that your elf? Oh, that one. Yeah. It's oh, eggy. Um, so yeah, at the moment yeah. the changes aren't that harsh. It's, it's mostly put a mask on. If you're vaccinated, you kind of got to download something to show that you're vaccinated. But yeah, just hope everyone can still get the Christmas that they went, they wish for this year. Um, it's my hair. But yeah, I hope you're doing well. Stay safe, guys. And uh, I'll talk to you in the next one. Say bye. Say bye. You say bye. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> bye, guys.